We lost 200 years. Not only did we lose 200 years, but these guys gained 500. So now they have their 500 ahead of us. Instead of, we could have been a lot closer. And that's this battle for ideas, right? You get this battle for ideas. Is this possible? Is that not possible? Do you believe in time travel? Do you believe in astral travel? Do you believe in telepathy? Do you believe in magic? All of these ideas, actually, they, they, they exist, <laughs> right? Advanced electronics, anti-gravity, space travel, uh, space colonies, you know? They, and this is, we basically live in a space colony. But now our civilization is split. So we have two, we have uh, at least two civilizations. Well, we have more. We have the two civilizations of human, right? You got the human 25th century and the human 21st. 20, oops. And then you got the, the Stellan, which are 25th plus. They can go much, they can go much higher. They can be 30, 40, who knows. But this group is in secret and they now can control the planet and they can manipulate society and the masses and they have the climate the climate weapons. They have space weapons. And because we are so far, oh, so at, so much at a disadvantage, we're trapped in uh, low, lower egoic thinking, gender wars, pain, disease, monetary systems, hatred, rights, uh, anger, we're here and don't, these people help us <laughs> so that we are not wiped out. Otherwise we will be wiped out because this, these people want us to be wiped out. But it didn't happen overnight. It happened over 2000 years, right? That they took advantage of new technologies, new, they stole new ideas. They talk to advanced people. They expanded their mind. They expanded their consciousness. Meanwhile, people here were denied expansion. And if you were expanding, you were called a witch. You were hunted. You were terrorized. They call you a conspiracy theorist. And so most people, the masses, the masses are in the 21st century, early 21st century. Some people some people kind of exist here but you know there's not so many of them and they believe in these new ideas and they use the most advanced technology and they're into quantum physics right they're here but that's still nothing the 23rd is still nothing compared to what they're doing here even your highest level thinking it's not, does not match what these people are doing because they're doing time travel, they're doing astral travel, they're doing interplanetary travel, they're traveling to different galaxies, they have healing technologies, they have de-aging technologies, right? They have advanced networks and they're talking to a lot of these people. You know, this stuff is completely science fiction to us. So, that's a little timeline science. It's based on frequency and consciousness. And whoever controls the advanced ideas can tell the others what to think, right? Through the television, through the movies, through the teachers. So even my, my view is even... You advance your thinking and you think outside the box, you, you're barely here. If, if you think this far, they call you crazy, right? If people are calling you crazy and you're pretty smart, you're reaching this level of thinking. 
but you're existing inside of a limited reality.